with the pressure gauge apparatus and in this experiment we are going to calibrate this pressure gauge. Um, for calibration we need to compare the uh, gauge reading with actual pressure. Uh, so first we need to remove this uh, piston part. Uh, here we are using water as the liquid. So we need to first uh, fill water in the cylinder. And then uh, the piston should be replaced. And we should allow it to settle. Uh, and then uh, we must make sure that uh, there are no any air bubbles in this transparent tube. For that we can just adjust this piston like this and remove the air bubbles. Uh, and then um, the first thing is we need to note down the piston area and uh, total mass of the piston part. Here in this note you can see the piston area and uh, the low, uh, mass of the piston. Uh, piston mass is 1 kilogram and the area is 315 square millimeters. That's given in this label. So you should first note down that. And then uh, we can take the initial reading. Initial reading then will be followed this 1 kilogram. You can see the, you can read the gauge reading. Uh, here the first reading is 30 kN per square meter. You can just uh, take that simply. Then we are going to add these weights one by one and take the corresponding reading. So let's do one reading. This is one kilogram of weight. So we are going to uh, add this weight. And uh, you have to wait some time to settle this. To settle, you can just uh, uh, do like this, the piston. For 1 kilogram, you can again take the reading here. Likewise, without replacing, uh, the removing the first load, you have to load all these weights and take the corresponding reading. And after adding all these weights, uh, you have to remove one by one and have the uh, reading at each remove. Uh, now the experiment is over there and then you have to uh, calculate the actual pressure because we are going to compare the actual reading, uh, actual pressure with the gauge reading. So for calculate actual uh, pressure, uh, you know the load, the pressure equals uh, load divided by area. So we are going to use that. Uh, here for 1 kilogram. One and this uh, piston, the whole weight is two kilogram. For two kilogram, uh, you have to calculate the pressure. Uh, you need to first convert this weight into uh, force uh, in newtons, and then uh, you need this area, piston area. For that, we can use a vernier caliper. And you have to just remove this, and this is the area. So we can use a vernier caliper and measure the diameter. Uh, and uh, so that's the end of the experiment.